morning. Hold on. Is that what you want? Happy? Say good morning. So poor Dave is in bed. He had his COVID booster yesterday and he's not feeling too good. So it's just us. We're gonna try and uh, <laughs> we're gonna try and make some lunch. Should we show everyone what we're gonna make? This could be a disaster, it could be slop. We're making parsnip and pepperoni Yorkshire pudding pizza. What do you think? Oof. Well, that says a lot about my cooking. Bonnie. Look at how the um, eggs come in gusto. They come in a little box. That's so cute. Bonnie. I love you. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> what have I made? Right, it now says to put on the chip ate the parsnip, so we're not doing parsnip anymore. Um, we've got mozzarella, cheese, honey, basil, pepperoni. So all of that just needs to go on. Oh yeah, and then first it's this onion marmalade and tomato sauce. Okay, it's out. Here's our Yorkshire pudding pizza. Do you know what? I think it looks, looks pretty good. So this is what happens when we make one meal. Barney Bear, how you doing? I'm all right, thanks. Thank you for taking such good care of me. You're welcome. Oh, Dave, hopefully tomorrow you'll feel better. Yeah, fingers crossed. I, do, I, think, I think I feel better than I did this morning. Um, so yeah, fingers crossed. Let me know if you want anything. Thank you, you're the best. <laughs> I love you. Love you. Come on, oh my God. A glass of water. Are we gonna do Advents? Should we do chip? Good job. Pick something out. Which one? Oh, it says it's a beef flavored sensory ball. It stimulates all your five senses, chip. Good boy, Chip. Good boy. Can you throw it for Chip? Oh. Here's yours. What are we looking for today? Number... Can you see it? <laughs> Ready. You get it. Wow. We do one more. It's number twelve. <gasps> it's a blue one. <laughs> Say thank you. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> right. So Barney's gone down for a sleep. Thank goodness. Not to be mean, but you can't get anything done. Oh, when he's awake. I just thought I'd show you like what's arriving, um, show you all like the exciting deliveries, which is just so fun when you start getting things that you've picked out and planned for and everything. Um, and I've had an update from the supplier. I spoke to him on Friday, I think it was, last week, and he said that there had been a cotton supply shortage, which I'm guessing is probably true with everything that's going on. Um, and that all their machines like ground to a halt. He said I should receive them this week and I was like well I received them by Thursday thinking I could maybe then just take the pictures of the last thing and then launch Thursday night because you know <laughs> who does that? <laughs> Me, I do that. Okay I got too excited so I've unboxed a few things. Should I try and spray paint this? It's not really on brand is it? Um, it's a big fat tape dispenser for the tape for the boxes. I went with this. I thought it would look really nice with the brown 
packaging of the boxes. Um, these are the thank you cards which have got the shop's name on it and like the logo. So exciting. So if you buy anything, oh, you'll be getting one of those. This is the filling. This thrills me. Does anyone else think this is so fun? <laughs> this is the filling for the boxes. Um, so I'm just going to sprinkle some of this in your order, which is very exciting. So this is a big box of these flat boxes. It's really weird buying packaging when you've not sold anything. You feel like really out of your depth, like, oh my goodness. But obviously if we didn't buy anything, then we wouldn't get it in time for Christmas. So fingers crossed. And then because it's Christmas, Dave thinks I'm crazy and he's annoyed because I've already spilled these all over the carpet. I bought these little gold stars just to sprinkle in the orders, you know, for a, a festive touch. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm so excited. Like, it's so fun seeing things arrive. I mean, this room is hopefully going to become an office. It's very much still a spare room and we want to keep it maybe as a spare room as well. It just depends. So it's just so exciting. I feel like I've waited my whole life to do this and I can't believe I'm doing it. I get to create things that people that love Florida and Disney World and people that enjoy like planning the trips and everything. I'm just, I'm so excited. Like this launch is tiny. There's so many things that I want to do and I just hope that this time next year, like this little shop of mine has grown and I've managed to like create all the things that I have on my vision board that I want to create. So look at the pink tape. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just so excited. It's bedtime. Do you want to say goodnight? <laughs> no, I'm too busy. <laughs> oh, right, so the house is an absolute tip, but I managed to get my pictures taken. Dave's still not feeling. Do you want to go outside? Um, Dave's still not feeling well, so I'm going to just bath Barney, put him to bed, and then I'm going to get editing on what I managed to take. Um, so that's really exciting, so... Yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Keep an eye on Instagram if you're interested in the launch. Um, that will be the first place I'll let you know when the last product arrives. And then once that's arrived, we're pretty much set to go. So, yeah, see you soon. Bye! Should old acquaintance be forgotten?